Welcome to Let's Play NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup Part 18. In this segment, we're finally going to do our next modified race, our 10th round of the Championship, not counting that charity race we did. We're going to New Hampshire for the New England 100, so... Hey, it might get... Hi, hi, hi. EA Sports is pleased to welcome all of you race fans to Loudon, New Hampshire. Today's race features future stars from around the country here at the New Hampshire International Speedway. Watch for lots of excitement heading into the corners. Braking will be very important as these drivers jockey for position. The start to today's race is just minutes away. We hope you enjoy all the modified racing action from New Hampshire International Speedway. All right, so I qualified third. How dare I not qualify on pole for a modified race? What the fuck? I don't know. Anyways, away we go, and immediately to the inside for the lead into turn one. So I got a far better launch than everyone else. So we got 25 laps here at New Hampshire. And what a hell of a start. So much for starting third. Because, uh, straight to P1. How long will I be able to hold this? Probably not very long, but... Ooh! contact right behind me as the uh, green boy went a little too wide off of four so yeah I'm not expecting to win this if I remember how New Hampshire modifieds go but I'll do my best do your best, do your best, do it every day. Always do your best. I'm gonna try to at least, you know, lead the first half of the race because championship implications gotta have those bonus points, yo. Loud in New Hampshire, more like loud ass cars, New Hampshire. Am I right? Haha, <laughs> jokes, anyways. Car boy doing a heckin' left. You bet your ass I am. Oh, someone's out with a blown tire. Looks like it might have been a left rear also. I think that was the guy running in third or something. Okay, maybe it wasn't actually. I still see a black and green car in my mirror, so never mind. We'll find out on the results screen. So there's one car out of the race now. Already. That took no time at all. That's what you get for using Continental tires. Anyways, five down, 20 to go. Still barely holding on to the lead. But I'm holding on to the lead. And that's all that matters. Ooh, almost gave up the inside. Very, very close. Let's not do that again. Thinking of streaming full length NASCAR races in Forza 7. That'd be interesting, GT. Oh, and way up the track he goes. For whatever reason. And. Well, bring on the next contestant, I guess. So far, doing so good. Maybe slow down a little too much on corner entry, but hey, it's fine. As long as I get that exit. As long as I hold the bottom and get a good exit, it doesn't really matter. Also, I always forget how, like, just wide this track is. Like, this track is fucking wide. Especially in the back. Like, holy crap.
Wait, why? Is there two blimps? Double blimp action, that's why. I don't even see any blimps. I see airplanes with fucking, you know, advertising things behind them. Because Bepsu. Oh, there's a blimp. It's the Goodyear blimp. Oh shit, NASCAR.com. Let's look at all the air advertising. So yeah, I only see one blimp. Oh god. Hi, how you doing? Oh, and he's gone. See ya. <laughs> Bye. Oh god, three wide. Behind me. Somehow that ended well. Go, go, go. And fucked it. Way, way too wide of an entry. Into three. Now he'd be doing a heckin' block. And I'm starting to lose grip. Must not let them get away. They're absolutely gonna get away. I don't have the grip to keep up. Of course, I would lose the lead just before halfway. So I probably won't get those points. Dang. Okay, I'm breaking way too late. Like, I'm trying to be aggressive, and I'm being too aggressive. The pizza is not aggressive. Not as aggressive as me, at least. We're almost dipping below 100 miles per hour. Tire wear! Alright, 10 laps to go. Let's try to at least hold on to a top 5 finish, maybe. Does aggressive go around all the time? Aggressive goes around. Ah, shit. I don't think a top 5 is happening. We've reached the point where they're now able to pass me on the outside. Are you not pitting? You can't pit in modified races in this game. Oh, keep it down, keep it down, there we go. Why so little grip? Because tire wear. That's why. My tires be wearing out. See? <laughs> what happens if you go into the pits and modify races? You just go through the pit lane. Like, I think it goes at pit speed, but, like, the game takes control, but it just... It just doesn't stop. It just goes through the pit lane and back out onto the track. Let's try to not let them get away. Meanwhile, as they easily get away. Yeah, pretty much. My tires are the only ones that wear. AI doesn't have to deal with this shit. Unfair advantage. Shitty game. Zero out of town. Fucking care. It's not four seconds yet. Jeez. Leader's got four seconds on you. No. In a lap, they will, but not now. Or not yet. I'm actually surprised no one else has passed me. Like, as was established like five laps ago, they can easily pass me on the outside. 
Damn, some retro gaming here. That's me. Hello, Seeks. Or XCs. I can read names. Ah. Hi, how you doing? Mr. 82. You're not the damn 76. Oh, God. Are we three wide? No, we're not. Yes, we are. Now they're passing me. Oh, rip top five. Rip top ten, I'm thinking. Jesus fucking Christ. I'm going backwards, and I'm going backwards quickly. Oh, and now I'm going to back go backwards even quicklier. Ooh. Hitting low, other dodge boy. That was way too close. On two to go. Let's try to get as good of a finish as I can get. Ah, once again... Too late on the brakes. I'm an Indica driver going backwards. <laughs> Anyways, final lap. Excuse me, Mr. Defensive Guy. What are you doing? Fucking lemon. Ah. Well, I gained a spot and I lost a spot, and I'm going to finish 10th, so top 10 at least. That went good. That went good. That was good. That was just fine. I'll take it. So, yeah, there we go. Another nice top 10. Walker wins from 10th starting... Damn, he started 10th. Fuck. And he gets the points for leading most laps. Boo! Oh well. So, there I am, third to tenth. Yay. Now, who's the guy that blew a tire way early? Oh, it was McFarland. Oh, okay, he started 14th, so no, he wasn't near the front of the pack, like I initially thought. He only lasted four laps, though, before the tire went dead. And therefore, his race went dead. Oh well. But, uh, yeah. Fucking disappointed cutscene. Not accurate at all as to how I feel about that performance. Her do 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 Anyways, no new messages. Okay, I was checking my hero mirror, I'm like halfway through level one. And here are the updated modified point standings. I think my lead has gone down from what I remember. I don't remember well. But still have a 43 advantage, 43 point advantage over Foster. Oh yeah, it definitely went down because he won the race. So, yay! The battle continues. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, I'll do it for this segment. So, here's our updated every fucking thing stats. And, um, yeah. We'll do some more trucks in next time on NASCAR, so stay tuned for that. Yeah.